question for today is uh, why is a concave lens required in order to correct myopia so as you know that uh, myopia as I am myself suffering it's a condition in which uh, I cannot see farther objects but I can see near objects so when light rays are coming from far away these light rays will be focused right on the way before reaching the retina so when they are at the retina at that time they are no more focused they are so diverse that's why the, the, the image formed in the retina on the retina will be very much unclear or blurred. But if the object is uh, nearer, so the light rays from that object will be uh, focusing on the retina itself. So that means the, uh, the eye will see such things clearer. So we have to have a mechanism, mechanism of bringing that uh, object uh, near by some means. So this can be done in two ways. One is to use a binocular and our telescope or, or the other is used uh, other is to use our concave lens so it is not feasible that we carry a binocular in the eyes or over the eyes but uh, it is uh, feasible that we carry a concave lens so in a concave lens as you see here uh, there are two light rays among the millions there are two light rays one is coming parallel to the principal axis which uh, diverges in such a way that as if it appears as if they are coming from the focus and the other is going through the optical center so it goes without deviation so no problem so here there is a virtual image formed now if I place my eyes here what it will see is it will see the image at this distance and it will see the object at this distance that means the image appears to be nearer to the eye than the object same technique is applied here so what you do is we have to bring the thing here to here from infinity to this distance so we will use a concave lens concave lens right in front of this this eye lens so that they will be brought nearer and after bringing nearer the uh, function of seeing is done by the eye lens